You certainly had some controllable and uncontrollable peaks and valleys in your rookie season. The thrill of getting drafted, I'm sure, was such an emotional high, and then you get injured I'm in mean, training camp, right? I mean, how, how, first of all, frustrating was that to not be available right away in your rookie season? Just the excitement of getting drafted and then training camp and then that happening. It was, of course, frustrating, but it was also kind of like, okay, I get a moment to see my favorite players and <laughs> not to be as focused. I get to kind of decompress and like take it in. So that was kind of like, I guess you could say that bright spot in there, but it was definitely, like you said, frustrating just coming from being drafted and that excitement of wanting to play. Take me through a Leah Wilson day. When did you first hear that this was going to happen? I believe a few weeks after I got drafted, uh, Actually, a few days after I got drafted, my mom told me the mayor had stopped by the house and was wanting to do something for me, you know, to celebrate. And, you know, it was really exciting because I feel like that moment was just itself was like eye opening. Just like, OK, like my, you know, my town wants to celebrate me and what it is that I'm doing. Don't think I was, you know, giving myself grace <laughs> at that time. So just knowing that the mayor himself wanted to do that and wanted to honor me, it was so exciting. At the park I grew up in, like just all that and seeing it come in full circle was like like an exciting little kid moment. <laughs> How would you describe that moment when you eventually were able to take the floor for the very first time and realizing a dream? Uh, it was exciting. I was definitely shaking in my boots, so. Uh, I don't know, I feel like that that moment itself, I just kind of had to like, like, okay, take a deep breath, <laughs> be where your feet are, because it was just so exciting. Obviously the injuries led to challenging circumstances at the beginning and at the end of the year. What were you most proud of, of what you were able to accomplish this year? Just, I don't know, I just feel like everybody's, everybody's process is different. So like you said, just being a rookie and knowing, you know, we dealt with a lot this season and just being able to come out of this with so much more like experience, a different, you know, mindset and mental towards everything and being familiar with, you know, the WNBA and Indiana and just knowing how much I have to look forward to.